Hey, I'm Marissa Bailey. Here are the stories making headlines at this hour. Concerns this morning after a man is arrested at O'Hare Airport for allegedly impersonating a police officer. Investigators say 27 year old Cameron Clark was at O'Hare wearing a CPD hat, a blue shirt that looked like a police shirt and dark cargo pants. He had a badge as well and allegedly told people he was a police officer when asked. And apparently this was not the first time. Detectives say Clark was wearing a similar outfit last week when he went to the O'Hare ID badging office, flashed a city ID and asked about access codes. In Northwest Suburban Elgin, police say they know who shot and killed a woman outside of a bar last weekend, but they need the public's help catching him. An arrest warrant has been issued for 23-year-old Shannon Smith of Chicago. The victim was his sister, 25-year-old Shapri Smith. Police say several people were arguing in the parking lot of the D Hangout Bar early Sunday morning when shots were fired. Smith was killed. Three other people were hurt. Happening today, a city council committee will decide whether a ban on horse-drawn carriages should go to a full vote. Alderman Ray Lopez, Brendan Riley, and Mike, Brian Hopkins support an ordinance that would prevent carriage operators from renewing their licenses this come November. They have strong support from animal rights activists, but carriage operators say the city wouldn't be as unique without them. You know, how many things are we going to drive out of the city till it's just a generic thing where there's no character left? We have documented, witnessed and documented uh, horses being overworked sometimes as long as 12 plus hours. A working horse is when it's been 90 degrees or hotter and also not providing water many times. According to the city, carriage operators received 334 citations last year and more than $20,000 in fines. The aldermen hope to eliminate carriage rides before the holiday season begins. Meteorologist Rob Ellis here now to look at your sunny forecast. Yes, a lot of sunshine is what we're expecting. Sunny for today, upper 70s, getting the temperatures to warm up during the afternoon. We'll cool it back down to a crisp and cool 59 for our overnight low. Light southeast winds continue that warming trend, although upper 70s yet again for tomorrow. More sunshine and well, the sunshine doesn't stop there. Take a look at the seven day forecast all the way through the rest of this week, even into the weekend where the temperatures get back into the mid 80s. All right, Rob, thank you and keep it right here on CBS Chicago for updates throughout the day. Have a good one.